is Kylie. This is Burroughs. How are you? I'm good. I really appreciate you coming through. I know you have a lot going on, so I know this is a quick meeting according to our previous conversation. Um, I know you read all the um, the notes from my reflection. I know you saw the um, the video. I did have a lot of annotations and I did see your note about that. And the reasons I have so many annotations is because I had to have enough resources to show that I was doing the formative and the summative assessment. So I kind of broke down the video a little bit more each time, just so I could have complete understanding of the criteria for the in-task standards that were required for this week. So do you want me to go ahead and pull up my reflection so we can kind of go through it? That'd be great. Awesome. And then you can just give me your notes and we'll do that really fast. So here is the reflection that we've already talked about. And I just want to let you know that I did share all the notes with you. I did see your responses to my feedback on um, what I would do differently. The only other thing that I would do differently is probably do it in more mini lessons. I just don't have enough time because we're switching to a new unit. So I'm really help, happy to hear your thoughts. Um, I wanted to also share the anchor chart that you suggested. Thank you, I did use that as a resource. And then the graphic organizer as um, a warm up for my, my learners who needed more um, support. So thank you for doing that. And I'm, if, you're, if it's okay with you, I'm gonna close down so I can get your thoughts, please and thank you. Yeah, um, I thought it was really great. Um, I thought it was effective when you, you were giving lots of really great instant feedback and um, through questioning and pray, right? Keeping them engaged, important. Um, and then just keeping their, uh, making sure they are understanding those vocabulary words. Um, I also thought it was effective. You used uh, multiple forms of assessment. We were, there was media and writing and movement. So you hit them all. I also thought it was effective to provide um, the brain breaks thing when you need them, which are, but then you um, like tied it into the lesson. So, right, they got both. Um, yeah, that was actually suggested by my instructor. So I wanted to make sure to get those brain breaks in because my kids have a lot of learning in a little bit of time, but they need those mental breaks to go to the next step. So thanks for that. Mm -hmm. um, and then I think uh, you also were using, so we have that data now from the learning continuum. So um, you can use that to help fill those gaps, know what they're ready for. And then you also like got a lot of, touched a lot of content areas with like science and math and grammar. So that cross-curricular. Was really great. Um, I didn't really have any areas of improvement really that stood out to me. Maybe I would just, just like suggest um, assigning that summative assignment first and then backwards planned to make really specific um, lessons and then you could do the summative again um, with like kind of modify it at the end and then you could kind of see where the growth happened and um, where you need to ex extend whatever the content knowledge. Um, but overall, it was great. Um, you used um, the standards while bringing that assessment forward. Um, I thought all everything was looked, it was obviously well planned. Um, students were given opportunities to self res, um, reflect good habit and, and change roles within the lesson while you were presenting evidence based instruction and including student preference, right, it helps with engagement. Um, and then even like making adjustments as you need to help accommodate all the students was really well done. Thank you very much. I'm hoping that I got all my high learners and my SPED learners. I did have a new student in that group, so I'm hoping that the approach went well. I really appreciate you taking the time to do this. I know you have a lot on your plate, so thanks again. We only yeah. have one more evaluation. Yay, four weeks to go. So I'm yeah. almost done. I really appreciate your thoughts. Thank you so much, Ms. Kylie.